Bro, I'm really about to get your pickle chin that boy. Hey, go ahead, come here, yeah, that boy. What's going on, everybody? So today, I'm finally getting around to making a video. I'm super sorry. Um, I haven't been on the YouTube channel in a while. I was traveling. I had to finish my senior year of high school. And uh, I've just been super busy with other things like moving. You guys see there's a new setup. So I have, in that time, acquired a lot of clothes, though. And uh, I have a lot of pickups, some really good ones that I want to show you guys. My style has changed a lot, but I hope to make more videos for you guys. I have a trip planned to LA in a few weeks, so I'm going to do a vlog there. Hopefully that'll go well, and uh, I can show you guys some of these pickups. I've had a lot on my mind recently, too, a lot of things that I want to talk about. So uh, maybe doing some just sit down and uh, some more videos outside of fashion. I'm really into uh, some things along with pop culture and obviously fashion, but music as well and the sort of art that I really love and I'd love to share with you guys and uh, do it on this platform. So without any further ado, let's get into these pickups. Um, I'll try to do my best of giving some on bodies or some close up shots of the uh, items. So starting off with my first pickup that I got in LA, I got these from Dover Street Market. They were like $2.50 or something like that, which is a little bit more than I wanted to pay for them. But a uh, really solid pickup, they're the Kiko Kostadinov ASIC. So um, these look really great with like shorts and uh, they have that nice tactical style that I'm going for. And uh, they also fit a lot of colors in my wardrobe, the blacks and the gray. So uh, this is a really solid pickup. I wish I got them for a little bit less, but uh, in the moment, I was in Dover Street, I was like, damn, I really like these, and uh, I picked them up, but I'm not regretting it, because I wear these a ton, and uh, I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of them in the summer. And then I guess moving on to uh, this, this is another pickup that I got in LA. I got this from Horror Vecchio, it is a capital long sleeve. If you guys can see, it has this American flag on the chest. And then on the other side of the chest, it says, sorry. It also has this really cool distressed like bone down the sides of the sleeves. I think this is a really cool piece and I like the way it fits. It has these nice like baggy cuffs, which I think is just a super cool detail. And um, it also fits very good. It goes right to like the waistband, which is like my favorite for clothes. I don't like them to be too long. Okay, being that I got both those things in LA, we'll just keep with that trend. Uh, another item that I got while I was on my trip was this Von Dutch hat. I got this from the Von Dutch store on Melrose. It's a really nice hat. It has this like trucker mesh in the back and uh, I've been growing my hair out. So uh, I try to wear a lot of hats lately, like this beanie or this hat. One of the last things I got in LA were these uh, Nike pants. Um, I got these at the Nike store on Melrose as well. They're uh, super comfortable. They're kind of joggers, which is a little bit cringy, but um, I managed to just wear these just chilling around the house. They have these really nice zipper pockets going on the side, which I really like. I think that's a really nice touch. And um, they make the pants very uh, useful for like everyday life, honestly. I'm pretty happy I got these. Moving on to the next pair of bottoms, I have these Nike and Alik shorts. I actually just got these because um, for my next trip, I wanted a pair of good shorts. It's going to be really hot. So um, I decided to pick these up. They're uh, this really nice like camo green pattern. They fall right above my uh, knee. This is another one of my favorite pickups, honestly. They have the really good zipper pockets, which I love. And they're just a low key uh, pair of shorts and they came with a pair of leggings underneath, but um, I didn't really think I was gonna get a lot of wear out of those. So I sold those on Grail for like $100, which I honestly thought was pretty good sell or sale um, because uh, I'm never probably gonna wear those and these were like 250 so that kind of brought the price down a little bit Which uh, is still a lot for a pair of shorts, but I'm probably honestly gonna wear this pair of shorts like every day this summer Moving on to another capital piece. This honestly is probably my favorite pickup in the whole video. It's this capital vest um, It's just so uh, it's so pretty it has all these different um, like little patterns and little like quilt. There's like this really pretty blue and like this seafoam green in the top left and then this like burnt orange and red and gray in the bottom. And uh, the, all the zippers say capital, which I think is a really nice touch. And uh, overall, it's just a really good vest. It's a little bit small on me, but I think it's gonna be very good for the spring to wear with like maybe shorts. I got this for like 375, which is more than I really wanted to pay for it, honestly, but it's definitely worth it. And I definitely think I could get more for it. I've seen some go for like 450 on ground. That's a little bit high, but uh, I definitely think I get my money back for it. But I don't really see myself selling it either. Uh, it's really pretty. And I think I could actually get a lot of wear out of it in spring and summer. 
this is another piece where I kind of try to step out of my comfort zone a little bit, I guess with colors. Uh, you guys see I have a lot of black and gray and I try to stick to that, but um, I tried to step out of my comfort zone and get this purple uh, hoodie. Some stains on the front, which kind of sucks. Um, I didn't know that, but I kind of just hit somebody up on Instagram for it because I didn't see anybody have it for sale anywhere. And I just kind of searched through Ray's Corrupted Minds tagged photos. Did a little bit of stalking and found somebody who sold this to me for like 125 which I honestly don't think is that bad of a price for it. Uh, I've seen some go for like 400 on Grailed, but I don't know, maybe that was just people going for ridiculous prices. It's a really cool hoodie. Uh, it's a little bit cracked, but um, it's a good chill hoodie. I don't wear it too much. And then last but definitely not least, I have this Gosha adidas track jacket this was like one of my most worn pieces over the winter i bought this in like november or december and i didn't come to like january um and i wore it every day like after that it's honestly such a good piece it has this really nice like tactical um look to it and uh, it just went really good with like the kikos or even more of my suey cokes some days when i was just chilling it has this like nice neck and these like ties on the neck which are kind of nice touch and then it says like soccer in Russian on the back. And it has a really nice oversized fit. It has this like really high neck too. And uh, this is also one of my favorite pieces. It's super comfy too, super baggy, it has these really cool nice pockets. But that completes the video. Those are all pickups that I've acquired in the last couple months. Um, just some of my favorite. I've also bought some things and sold some things you guys haven't seen. But uh, again, I hope to keep you guys posted on this channel a lot more. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to post a vlog from my trip. So let me know if you guys want that. And also let me know what you guys want in the comments. Also probably have some good pickups from my trip. Uh, I hope to get a lot of clothes there because I've been saving my money to kind of buy clothes in person instead of online. I love online shopping, but sometimes uh, it's cool to buy things in person too. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.